These are the top 10 things you should be buying at Walmart this August 2022, and there's a huge selection of amazing deals for every corner of your home. Let's begin with a $98 Chromebook. I know on this HP Chromebook, you will see a price of $100 in store, but it's actually $98 online, and I will highlight all of the price discrepancies between online and in-store throughout this video. The important point is this is the exact same price for a nearly identical model that was featured as a Black Friday doorbuster that you can buy right now. I'm personally not a huge fan of Chromebooks, especially with specs like this, but they are favored by educational institutions, and your son, daughter, or grandchild may need to buy one. And speaking of incorrect price tags at Walmart, these next Next two dash cams are actually fantastically priced, but you wouldn't know that unless you're watching this video or you take the time to scan the item with the Walmart app. I saw this advertised for $80 in store, but it is actually $63.99. A basic HD dash cam to hold other drivers accountable, perhaps support your insurance claims. And the 1080p HD model that you see right here at $89.83 online had an in-store price of $100. Don't let that in-store price dissuade you. It's another interesting product that I found is this personal chiller LED lighted mini fridge with different color options and a mirror door. You could bring this into a dorm room or student apartment to keep your beverages or your cans cool. You can select the settings for $29.88 down from around 40 bucks. Before I expose some incredible prices on tech, including TVs and laptops, in the number two spot with kids heading back to school this week and next week across the country, Walmart often beats the Dollar Tree when it comes to all sorts of back to school essentials, including writing notebooks like the ones you see right here, 35 cents versus the buck 25 you would pay at Dollar Tree. Elmer's school glue, 54 cents, again, compared to that buck 25 you'd pay at Dollar Tree. The store brand of this, just 25 cents. Elmer's glue sticks, 54 cents. A 24 pack of crayons, 35 cents. The store generic brand, 25 cents. A 10 pack of washable markers, 50 cents. A 12 pack of Crayola colored pencils, 97 cents. The alternative brand, 75 cents. You'll also see these pencil boxes sold at Walmart. They will look very familiar to frequent Dollar Tree shoppers like myself, except at Walmart, the price, 97 cents. These are from the brand Sterilite and made in the USA. In the number three spot, if you cannot wait until Black Friday to upgrade a television or wait to replace one that might be malfunctioning, the TV deals I'm seeing at Walmart are extremely competitive on many of the entry-level television sets, as well as some solid smart TVs for fall football watching. The $379 regular price on this 55-inch TV down to $298 is surprisingly well rated from all of the customers that have favored this TV, which is in fact made by Walmart's in-house brand. I should mention none of these products are sponsored. Walmart is not paying me to make this video. The 65 inch TCL TV that you see right here, also extremely well rated for a good 4K 65 inch entry level smart TV. The Roku operating system is quite easy to navigate, 398 down from 448. If you expand the video description box, you're also gonna find links to all sorts of other products, including a decently specced out mid-level laptop, the Gateway 15.6 inch ultra slim notebook you see right here, has an Intel Core i3, eight gigs of RAM, and a 250 gig solid state drive. I like that it has a fingerprint reader and for 299 to score eight gigs of RAM, not the fastest computer you'll ever see, but it is well-priced. I've collected a lot of requests recently for brand name in-ear headphones and the Beat Studio Buds do top that list. They typically sell for 150 bucks. They are $99.95 from Walmart, which is a great price. You do have several color options. All are reduced except for the blue. My wife bought these in red. I personally don't think they stay in that well, although the audio quality is great. She uses them to run. I don't have the stamina for that, but pushing a new baby stroller, they do come in handy. I realize I'm highlighting all sorts of price discrepancies between the Walmart app and the actual price tags you'll see in the store. Generally, if the app has a lower price and the item is shipped from and sold by Walmart, that same price should be guaranteed to you via checkout. And if it isn't, 
An associate will likely adjust these days because the Walmart app price is the price that goes. For point four, I want to highlight a couple of small appliances that are highly in demand right now. This compact countertop microwave for $45 is a great price, but if you are looking for something a little bit more well-featured, a little bit larger, the $60 Hamilton Beach model that you see right here has that easy pull handle. And similar to the Mainstays microwave I just showed you, this is available in three different colors. This is $59. If you haven't quite adopted the air frying technology in your household yet or you've been on the fence, the Power XL Vortex Air Fryer for $90 reduced from $129 is a highly competitive price on a very well-reviewed model for students heading off to college. For $16.96, you can buy a small compact George Foreman indoor griller. I think I did use this exact model in college. It was a little bulkier in my day. And before I get to some awesome cleaning products, this next small appliance has a very big price attached to it. But since Nugget countertop ice makers have been so in demand this summer with people typically paying $100 more than the $349 you'll see for this. Frigidaire system. I am including this in my video for any reason it's on your shopping list or within budget for your family. In the number five spot for pet messes, people messes, I wanted to try this product before I made any recommendations. It's a heart spot cleaner. It has a 51 ounce tank and it can apparently get all sorts of stains out of your carpet and various types of upholstery. So with a little spill, a few seconds of time, and after reading the instruction manual, which I don't usually do for products, this $69 spot cleaner went to work. I can conclude this device is well worth the price of admission. If you just need a simple corded vacuum, this very well-reviewed Bissell 3-in-1 is lightweight. It doubles as a dust buster type hand vac and is also great on both carpets and hardwood floor for $29.98, down from $37.96. If you're looking for a slightly higher end, cordless alternative, the Tineco iFloor wet dry vac you see right here for $124, down from $199 is another fan favorite. And this Shark Vac and Mop 2-in-1 is $0.08 cents more in-store, but if you buy the exact same product online for $0.08 cents less, you score an entire bottle of cleaning solution as well as 12 disposable mop pads. You would not be getting any of this if you opted just to make the purchase in-store. Again, expand the video description box. You will find a link to this. I do use affiliate links, which means I benefit monetarily if you're kind enough to use one of my links. In the number six spot, things are getting hot in here. It's because of these fire pit deals. And this 30-inch square wood-burning fire pit at $79 to begin with includes a wood grade, a lifter, and a spark screen for a $79 price reduced from a list price of $92, also very well reviewed. This next product is only available in store, but it has a fantastic price at $25. This fire pit might not look as fancy and it is two inches smaller than the one that I just showed you, but it also includes a cover and a prodder. If a more substantial fire pit is within budget, this one right here also functions as a tabletop and it's a more compact version of that higher end fire pit you might see at a nice restaurant, 158 down from 194. To pair with the fire pit, also only available in store, a two piece rocker set with cushions at $50 per rocker. This combo is an aggressive deal. For a smaller space, a patio or a deck, this $89 three burner propane gas grill can apparently cook up to 15 burgers at the same time. I think they'd have to be slightly smaller than the burgers that I make my family, but here's a nice photo of it for $89. And as we inch closer to the fall and having to handle all of those autumn leaves, the Heart 20 volt cordless blower that you see right here with a lithium ion battery included for $96, both online and in store is not actually as good of a deal as the one I'm about to show you. For $96, again, you get the 20 volt cordless blower right here from Hart, but for $2 more at 98, you get the same 20 volt blower and a 10 inch string trimmer, as well as a battery to accompany that for $2 more. Again, for $98, you get the blower and the trimmer. That could be a pricing error. So expand the video description box and you might want to click that link while it's still available.
Before I show you what I would not buy, if you're wondering why there's so many price discrepancies between the online and app price with all the price tags you see in store, it's simply because with the immense stock every Walmart has, as price drops or rollbacks occur, store associates can't always make their way around to every price tag to adjust it, hence the discrepancies. For point seven, I've received many requests to review the dollar shop finds from Walmart. So I'm excited to provide that now. The ring trays you see right here for a buck 50 say, I do on them. Well, this could work for an actual wedding or exchange of rings. They're a great way to store your rings if you take them off at night or when you shower. Fall scented candles at $3, smelled fantastic at my Walmart, and thanks to my wife, I do have some higher candle standards. The scents include spiced apple cinnamon, pumpkin spice, cedar wood, and this new thing called rosewood vanilla. I have no idea what that even means, but it's my new favorite. Who would have known? These pet collars and leashes are priced at $1.25, which I consider a solid price. Now that I've had a chance to interact with these in store, between the rope quality and the pleather accents, these are surprisingly impressive. With the fall and winter approaching, Ultra cozy fuzzy socks for $3 are of a higher quality than you'd see at Family Dollar or Dollar Tree. And if buying to-do pads are on your to-do list, they're 75 cents at Walmart, hashtag dad pun. One thing I want to mention is the Walmart dollar section has a large amount of fall decor available right now. But I do not think that $5 price reflects the quality of my local Dollar Tree. I would give this section a thumbs down and I would wait until the items shift to clearance or some type of reduced pricing. In the number eight spot as a great alternative to paper plates for picnics, fall hosting, unexpected guests. The mainstays plastic dinner plates that you see right here are priced at 50 cents each. Available in a nice collection of colors with the same colors also available for these 26 ounce plastic tumblers. I wanted to buy and try this two tier beverage dispenser at $13.98 because this organizer auto dispenses the next can when you remove one. One of these on its own is significantly more expensive from Amazon, so I'm happy with what I purchased from Walmart. If you're short on drawer space or pantry storage, these mainstays cabinet organizers allow you to accommodate anything from cleaning cloths and supplies to aluminum foil and all other sorts of baking supplies on the sides of your cabinet doors for $10.74. For a basement, a storage room, pantry, prepping, all sorts of ways that you could put this five-tier shelf to use. The $65 price reduced from $75 is for a shelf that apparently has a 1,750-pound capacity. That's impressive. For $5 less, this four-shelf metal storage rack is $60. And if you just need a three-tier version, this stackable wire shelf at $28.68, which is very well rated, has a 750 pound capacity. I was also intrigued by these large $2 utility buckets. These would be great for storing paint, gardening supplies, salt or sand for the winter. Just wonderful to have on hand for any unexpected leaks. They've got an American flag on the exterior and I am not too sure how long this $2 price will last. Before I get to more fall favorites, I want to dedicate this next point to my neighbor, Jeff. Jeff asked if I could find him an air mattress deal. His traditional mattress is hurting his back. I said, why don't you want a regular mattress? He said, it's because the deal guy told me to wait until Labor Day for really good traditional mattress deals. So Jeff, for 55 bucks, you can buy this. This Queen Air mattress has a pump. And although you'll be spending $55 now, you'll likely be saving hundreds of dollars on a more appropriate mattress come Labor Day. As an alternative, this air mattress, which also includes a pump, is $28.28, although it just places you much closer to the ground. This 8-inch memory foam mattress in full is $199 for Queen, $248, and King, $296. If you're looking for a couch that doubles as a bed, this studio futon for $129 would be great for a spare room or even a student apartment where one might need to host a sibling or a family member visiting them at college. I haven't seen too many storage bins with wheels, so this 200-quart storage bin at $49.98 
caught my eye. It's giant. I like the practicality of the wheels, which makes the higher price understandable. This could also be great for lugging around those heavier holiday decorations. If you've had your heart set on one of those motion sensor kitchen garbage cans, you'll know they are expensive. And the $39 price on this very well-reviewed stainless steel one might be a good option for those of you interested. For the next point on my list, let's move on to a favorite around holiday time for, for holiday baking, Thanksgiving, or just good old mac and cheese. Dutch ovens succumb to huge demand around the holiday time. The price you see right here on this 5.5 quart version for under 50 bucks is not only highly competitive, but it's significantly cheaper than a comparable item from Target. With the way the economy has affected so many of us and the rising cost of food, a slow cooker is a way to grab a bunch of ingredients and make a series of meals at the beginning of the week that will last you. The $25 Hamilton Beach slow cooker you see right here, which serves at least seven people, is very well priced. For countless people who have shifted to exclusively making their own coffee from home, this Keurig machine you see right here is brand new and allows you to control the ounce size it dispenses. Many of the other single serve Keurig machines only produce one size. This one here allows you to select between the three different size options. If you're brewing coffee for an entire household or a small office, this $99 price is the lowest price I've seen tied to a Keurig machine that handles not only pods and K-cups, but it also houses a coffee pot and can accommodate coffee grounds. For $89, this mini fridge would be great in a bedroom, a basement, or an office. And if you are seeking a more traditional fridge design, this quite a bit smaller than a standard appliance double door mini fridge at $157 also has interior lighting. And now for the bonus section, which includes a $3 chair that I will wrap up with. But first, it might surprise some of you to learn that Walmart has cheaper solar lighting than the Dollar Tree or Family Dollar. The solar pathway lights you see right here for 97 cents are the least expensive ones I have seen sold anywhere. To add some other great types of lighting to an outdoor area, these LED frosted globe string lights are $9.94 for the whole pack. If you are shopping early for Christmas, I know bikes are on many holiday gift lists. You never know what stock you'll see around Christmas. So the adult bikes at $98 and kids bikes at Walmart for $78 are very strong prices. For tailgating, fall sports, or extracurricular activities, my four-year-old daughter is playing soccer, the $8.87 price you see attached to these mesh folding chairs online is not nearly as attractive as the in-store $3 price I found for the exact same foldable mesh stores at multiple Walmarts in my area, so keep an eye out for these. And that brings us to the end of this list. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. Bye-bye.